Hi, Cameron. Hello. What's going on? Yo. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What are we doing tonight? Something that you don't want to do. What do you mean I don't want to do? You sound like you don't want to do it. Of course I want to do this. I've been wanting sure. to do this for weeks. Sure. You tell the audience that. Um, where did we leave off last time? Um, we were in a new place with a new person. Are we, um, in the same Poison. spot, kind of? Yeah. Oh, wait, did you start already? Did no, well, I'm, I'm about to. Alright, I'm gonna do a two. Yeah, I just opened up the file to recollect. Um, so it looks like we're in some kind of a... We gotta give her tea or something, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Or no, we have to sit down for tea or something. You know what, I, I think there's something wrong with the audio. Why? Well, I can't hear the pocket mirror stuff. There's no music playing, it's just a fire crackling. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, here we go. Alright, I think I just adjusted the volume a little better. Um, so, what are we doing? Who even is this again? What's her name? Um, Eve? No, 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 the, the new girl. Um, Harpe. Mm. Interesting. Do you want me to read her parts, or do you do you want to read oh. her parts? Um, I think you were reading her parts, but what are we doing? Um, what am I supposed to? A glass tray filled with various kinds of sweets and tea. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna explore the room real quick. Yeah, me too. I'm checking out the fireplace. I've never fallen in front of it says the flames dance eerily, hurried, spontaneous movement illuminating their <coughs> surroundings with a faint yet yarn glow. Um, this game is so scary. No, it's not. Yes. Where are you going, miss? Oh, so I guess I can't leave the area. Alright, let's go. S I'm a spit. Uh, oh, wait, there's a book here. It's too, too dark. dark to read, yeah. Alright, well, um. A great variety of objects rest on the numerous shelves. Okay, nothing there. An aged grandfather clock stands next to the fireplace, both its arms and pendulum hanging still as it's frozen in time. Um. Okay. I'm gonna sit down now. Where do we. Yeah, okay. Do, do we have to sit down? Is that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. So th those are the options sit or don't sit. Mm -hmm. Should I sit? Totally. <laughs> Alright, I'm sitting. Am I reading hard paste parts? Yeah. Okay. 
I've been waiting for you for a long time, miss. Oh. You have? Yes, I have. <laughs> Although I do know it might sound strange. I... That's... We've never met before, have we? Hmm. No, not like this. Y you may think you may think of me as your guardian angel, miss. I will always be here to protect you. I still have so many questions. I will try I will try my hardest to give you the answers you're looking for. Then I What's my name? Who, who am I? Where are we? What should I do? What are you gonna ask? Um, I don't. I don't think we're gonna get her name because I, I think last time we tried to got, uh, get her name, we didn't get her name. Um, who who am I is too broad. Who am I is too broad. What should I do or where are we? Um. I don't care where we are, to be honest with you. Because she's going to give, like, a really vague-ass answer. Like, oh, we're in my house or something, you know, like... <laughs> or we're in Indiana. <laughs> like, super fucking vague. Um, I want to do... Oh. What should I do? Oh, dang, I accidentally pressed... <laughs> where where are we? <laughs> That's okay. I'm going to do... What should, what should I do? Okay. Well, she says, we're in my home. See <laughs> what I say, and I say I see. <laughs> do you live here all by yourself? And she's like, "Yes, I do." Although it does get quite lonely at times. Harpe, and I say Harpe. She says yes. Oh no, I was just thinking it must be hard living alone. She's like, "Oh, you're truly kind, Miss." Ah, uh, I just. No buts, miss. Only... Never mind. Um, a true lady knows when to take a compliment. And I'm just like, dots. Thank you, Harpe. You're welcome, miss. Alright, you go read yours. Alright, so mine, um... The Eve character, uh, is saying, I feel lost, and I don't know where I am. Or even where to go. Harpe, I see... And Harpe, you dot dot dot. You seem like such a reliable person. I was hoping you could give me some advice. <laughs> now Harpe saying, "Oh, my poor little girl. I understand why. Why you'd come to me for guidance. There isn't much I can tell you about my humble home. However, there are things I must warn you about, Miss. Warn me about what." Um, I may, uh, and this is Harpe talking, I may be good-willed, but there are people who aren't. And then Eve's character is like, uh, like that girl who chased me earlier? Harpe, exactly. You mustn't approach her no matter what happens, or I'm afraid you will not emerge unscathed. Dot, dot, dot. Don't be afraid, miss. I will make sure to protect you against any kind of ad adversity. <laughs> and then Adversary. Ha um. You sure? Hey, do you want to share screens? Do you want me to share screens with you? No. No. You sure? Mhm. Mm okay. Mm, and then heart pace like, but I'm sure that even without my help you will be able to sur surpass these hardships. And then your character says, uh, Harpe, dot, dot, dot. And then Harpe says, yes. <laughs> and then your character says, thank you. Your character says, I feel a bit more reassured now. Harpe says, you're welcome, miss. You have finally smiled. <laughs> your character says, thanks to you. Harpe's character says, 
that is the expression that fits you the best, miss. I wish for nothing more than your happiness, and I will do everything in my power to see you smile. <laughs> Thank you, Harpe, your character <laughs> says, and then Harpe says dot dot dot. And then that's the end of that interaction. Oh, wait, nope, there's more. Uh, your character says, I still have one more thing to ask about you. Uh, okay, wait. Okay. Um, so, so, I just said dots, and then Harpe was like, you finally smiled. And I'm like, thanks to you. Mm -hmm. And she's like, that is the expression that fits your best, miss. So I wish you nothing but having a power see smile. Thank you, Harpe. Dots. And then now I'm where you are. So now your character says, "If I that's still all right." Have one more thing. If that's all right with you, go ahead. Do you know of a girl named Fleta? Fleta? I don't think so, Miss. Although it does sound quite familiar. I see. Did anything happen? <laughs> oh no. I was just wondering if you you had heard of her, that's all. Dot dot dot. Hmm. Ooh, the clock strikes twelve. Well that's just a coincidence. Oh I'm my. Late. I'm late for a very important date. It sure does fly by when you're entertained, doesn't it, miss? Yes, it does. You should drink your tea before it cools. What if I like iced tea? Um. <laughs> oh, see, there's a... Drink or don't drink. So, I think she's going to poison us. What do you think? Uh, well, you can don't drink it, and I'll drink it. I can don't drink it? I want to drink it. No, you don't drink it. Alright, I'm a don't drink it. And I'm a drink it. So, Eve's character says, Oh no, I'm fine, thank you. And now she says, I will, thank you, Harpe. So then Harpe says, Is that so? Uh, uh. I actually brewed that tea specifically for you. Specially for you. And Harpe says, oh, I almost forgot. And Eve's character says, dot, dot, dot. And then Har oh, well, damn it, I died. Ah! No, wait, no, I didn't. Wait, Hold on. what the fuck? Maybe. I did, I don't know. Did you? No, okay, so, so, so I'm choking, it seems. Well, she's, Gib is coughing. And then Harpe's like, is everything alright? And Gibbs like, there's... And Harpe's like, what is it? Did she, like, brew it with dicks or something? Like, she's, like she's choking on dicks? <laughs> so, okay, so my character says, Please don't make such a pained expression, my girl. It's fine. I'm not upset. I just hope the tea would be to your liking. Then your character says, If that's the case, I'll drink it. So, I guess I'm going to end up drinking it? <laughs> Alright, okay, yeah, drink it, and then let me see if you're going to cough. Because there, there's a decision for me again. Okay, well, Tarpe says, there's no need to force yourself, miss. Oh, no, I insist. And now Harpe's character says, thank you. So now it looks like she's maybe drinking it? And now she says, uh, uh, Harpe says, oh, I almost forgot. And she's walking away, something broke, and it sounds like Eeb's character is like choking. Mm -hmm. Dot dot dot. Is everything alright, Harpe says? Your character says, there's dot dot dot. My character says, what is it? Um, and so the option is, there's something in there's the tea. There's something in the tea, you know it's nothing. What are you going to say? I'm going to say there's something in the tea. Um, I guess I'll say, no, it's nothing. Alright. And Harpe's like, what do you mean? It, yeah, it's same thing with me. It says, what do you mean? And she's like, there's something inside the tikka. Mine says, it was nothing. I just dot dot dot. And then Harpe's like, I see. 
And then, I'm sorry. And then my heart pace says, you just question mark. <laughs> and she's like, I, I apologize, miss. And, and then I'm like, no, no, it's all right, Harpe. I also overreacted. And then Eve's character says, it was just too hot, don't worry. Uh, <laughs> and then Harpe's... Harpe's oh. Yeah, Harpe says dot dot dot. Harpe's like, I'm truly sorry, my girl. Is there any way I could ever compensate you? And I'm like, there's no need to compensate me, Harpe. I'm alright. And it wasn't that bad. Harpe's like, but I... Dot, dot, dot. And then I'm like, your tea was delicious. And Harpe's like, dot. Thank you, miss. Um, my Harpe says, I see, dot, dot, dot. Actually, I have prepared something else for you. Yep, yeah, she says that for me, too. And then I'm like, oh, Harpe, you didn't have to. Yep. Yes, I did have to, miss. <laughs> Today is a very important day. It must be celebrated. Is it my birthday? And looks like she's walking away to the bookshelf, sitting back down. And Harpe says, I made this for you, my girl. Oh, wow. A Harpe's card again. Harpe's card. It's cardigan. what I always wanted. I hope you like it. It is so pretty, Harpe. <laughs> and is this really for me? Of course. Of course! Of course! Of course! Is, is that like our new inside joke now? No. No? Okay. I'm just kidding. Of course! Of course! I made it myself, just for you. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Harpay. You're welcome, miss. Am I gonna put it on? Ew. I think it's on. Yeah, she put it on. It does fit you well. I'm so glad. <laughs> it's very comfortable, too. It itches like hell. <laughs> See, she's itching. Thank you so much, Harpe. Gosh, it smells like roach spray. <laughs> you can stop thanking me, my girl. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll take good care of it. Gets blood on it. Thank you, miss. Well, then. I should go make more tea. You must be quiet, thirsty. Oh, no, I'm fine. Oh, no, I insist. I want to compensate you for what happened earlier. There's no need for you to, but all right. Now wait here for a little while. I will be back soon. In the meanwhile, feel free to read some books. Thank you, Harpe. Do you think Harpe is a robot? Nah. I think she is. I'm a save. That's why I was giving her a robot voice. What if this whole, this whole game is like she's a robot? Nah, it's something more horror field than that. Something more what? Horror field. Oh. We've only been playing this game for like five hours. Am I wrong? Or. How long has yours been playing? Yes. Um, yes, what? I should wait here for Harpe. So I guess she can't go down. And I think Harpe wanted us to read a book. It's too, it's too dark to read. Okay. So can we pick up this candle? Great variety of objects, ways, blah, 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 blah. Okay. We can't pick up the candle. Are you like... I acquired a pumpkin charm. Oh uh -huh. shit, something just broke. What was that? What was that? That was my line, get out of here. Oh, okay, well, wasn't sure if we're in the same. <laughs> Acquired another pumpkin charm. Various volumes of sheet music are lined on the bookshelf. 
Are you still walking around? Totally. I'm up. I. Uh, oh. You're what? Hey. <laughs> you. You can. Uh, you can leave the room now. Oh, can I? Maybe. Let's leave the room. Now that shit's broken. Okay. I'm leaving the room. So it looks like it's some kind of a ship? Like a pirate ship? Am I wrong? <laughs> Say that while holding your tongue. Um. So I just went straight up. Are you gonna go straight up? Oh yeah, I'm there already. Okay, well I'm gonna go up the stairs. I'm gonna keep going up. It's like up and right. Are you going up and right? I'm finished. I'm at dialogue. I'm waiting for you. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, there's a door. Is that where you went in? Totally. Okay. I'm in the door. Um, looks like a church. Harp Hey? Harpe? That's. It sounds like wind. Mm-hmm. Alright, so I'm, I'm going straight down. Um, uh, you can be question mark. Alright. Father, look! I drew this for you. Do you like it? Yes, of course. Now listen here, my girl. Do you remember what I told you this morning? Yes, father. You must not pester me tonight, as I will be busy attending an important meeting. Understood? He gonna be fucking bitches. He gonna be fucking bitches. Yes, father. Now resume your studying. You must waste. You mustn't waste time doodling aimlessly. Yes, father. So it's two people that I'm reading for. Is there anyone else here? I just heard coughing. Does. So I'm walking around. Um, well, I went, um, uh, left. I, I can't go left. Um. And, and she said, is anyone in there? Yeah, yeah. I think I'm gonna die. Wait, you're there too? Well, I, I can't go left, so I have to go down. So I'm down to the right, and it says, it's so windy outside. So I'm, I'm guessing I'm at, like, broken windows. And it looks like there's a safe Wait, spot. Wait, you went down to the right? Yeah, down and right, and there's a safe spot. So I'm gonna save. Where? Um, down and to the right. I need it. Oh, I found it. And I'm saving. And we're at 5 hours and 19 minutes playing this game so I can't keep going right because it says it's too dark I'm at 5 hours and 15 minutes how am I ahead of you? Yeah, you spend more time doing stuff I guess the bust of an important looking man his menacing well defined features are deeply engraved into the marble a blemish painting of a crying girl running through the dark woods wearing badly torn dress. Gown. Gown, okay, I'm sorry. My bad. You know my English is horrible. I went down from there. Down, okay. I too will be going down. I'm scared. It's a video game. So it looks like there's some kind of a pentagram or something? Where? On the left? Oh no, it's a keyhole. Uh. And I can't. Oh shit! Okay. Did you see what? that? The keyhole. No. Okay, just just look through the keyhole. No. Okay. I went to the desk. There's an open journal on this desk. Okay. Well, there's a keyhole, and I insist you view it. I don't see any keyhole anyway. All right. Well. Therefore. You probably kept going down, didn't you? Yeah. Well, I'm all the way down, and there's nothing... No, like, down from the, the bus 
in the statue. Oh, oh, I thought you meant down, like, down the hallway. No. Oh, got it. There's a down? Yeah. Where the busts were? Uh-huh. Oh, I see, okay. I went to the original hallway. And then there was a keyhole. This looks like some kind of a lab, maybe? A library. Library? With some kind of a red vase. And it says lamp. Lamp. And it says there's an open journal on this desk. I had never intended to break this family apart. This incident is nothing more than an unfortunate twist of fate. Or so I want to believe. However... I have become un unable to tolerate such outbursts of utter madness. To believe that this family has become nothing more than a vile being's plaything is completely outrageous and unacceptable. I shall take responsibility for your actions as my final loving gesture so, you so that you may rest in peace. To you, my dear. I owe all the fe affection I could ever give you. Were you to live any longer? The rest of the pages are stuck together. Oh, uh, was this guy like jizzing like all over? I is it a, like a porno magazine? Definitely. He was like... So we, there's you, a letter you can't see me, phone. but I'm like, you know, doing the jerk off symbol. Right. On, on screen. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sergeant Major Roman per de Hillage. I hereby leave you this letter in regards to your daughter's behavior during my tutoring classes. I believe it has come to your attention that she is not in the most what? healthy estate. What are you reading? <laughs> a leather, a leather on the floor. A leather on the floor? Yeah. Leather? Yeah. Like there's a dead cow? Uh-huh. Okay. If not, then I would suggest you consult a doctor. Recently, she's been demonstrating a bizarre tendency for violence, which is reflected in her nervous outbursts during my classes. Things such as ripping pages off her books, suddenly scribbling over her own notes, and throwing tantrums when she was asked to read have become the norm. She was just having seizures, bro. Do you think they're really seizures if those pages were stuck together? Yeah. However, as a servant as these behaviors might seem, her true violent tendencies are aggravated to the point of ripping her own hair off doing lectures and attempting to hurt herself with the quill. See, these are just see she was having seizures. Do you like get stuck pages in, with seizures? In that wasn't her book. But involuntary muscle movement. Or involuntary orgasmic pleasure. But I'm just saying, like, he's talking about the daughter. She was having seizures in class, that's it. Like, she had epilepsy or something. Or maybe she was jizzing all over that page, or all over that book with all the pages that are stuck together. I myself have occasionally become the target of these hysterical behaviors, and that's, uh, I refuse to tolerate any further. I am sending you this letter of resignation. Oh. It just skipped. Yeah, well, it, there's a cutscene thingy. There's dialogue. It's a pretty long letter. I want to read it all. Yeah, well, I guess we can't. Der Frühen Greiber by Friedrich Godeb Klopstock. There's another grandfather clock. Welcome, O Silver Moon. There, silent companion of the night. You flee? Hurry not. Stay, so friend of thoughts. See, it, it stares, the cloud only billowed towards it. Are you, are you reading the other letter that's there? No. Oh. May's Awakening is only more beautiful still like the summer night when the dew drops wait what are you what are you reading it's a on the ladder on one of the bookshelves dew drops from may's locks 
clear as light, and up the hill it comes, reddish. You, more noble ones, alas, solemn moss, already grows on your tombs. Oh, how happy I was, as I still saw you. Oh, shit. Saw with you. See, what, what are you doing? Um... I just found I just found something call, uh, called called uh, an old wax record. Oh, okay, so nothing scary. No, okay. it, it just it caught me off guard. So like, if you if you go upstairs, I'm reading in German. Okay, we'll keep the reading. Dawn, vision, the night shimmer. Okay, I'm finished. How do you run again? Minus. Shift. Mine is a memoir on madness by Philip Pinel. Philippe. No. The clock's hand are hang down loosely, Shh. weakened down by the passage of time. Got some pumpkin charm. Okay, that was weird. What? I just heard a loud shh. Vorshku Uzu Ins Historian Ferris Carus by Adam Muller. Is that what you're reading? Sh mm, I don't know. Schneweb Schnewebchen Dizos und Rosenrat by the brother Brother Grimm. The oh it's oh oh this is um this is Snow White by the Brother Grimm. Oh, you know. nice. These all seem to be medical yeah, letters. I understand. I understand German. These are all written in Braille. I'm, uh... I'm, I'm at dialogue. Do you want me to wait for you? Yes. Okay. Do you want me to tell you where? What dialogue? Mm-hmm. So, on the top left... Or, okay, so you're if you're on the main floor... Oh, no, I acquired an old wax wicked. Yeah, that's that's what I okay. So that wasn't so scary. On well, on the left side of that, there's okay. some medical. On the left side of that room, on the okay. same level, th there's like some letters on the uh, the corner there. Oh wait, did you play the record? I did. And what happened? A loud shh. Oh. That's what caught me off guard. Are you still kind of walking around? No, I'm gonna play the wicked. Oh, I thought you you were there already. No. Hey, I want some Wendy's. Do you want some Wendy's? No. If I took you some Wendy's, would you eat it? Oh, it's Wax Wicked 105. I am recording this. What? Are you Leave recording? Leave you my... My children. What? My testimony of what I have... Of our lives. A being whose... Hold my beloved daughter's... Everything mother could do for... Hope is... Your pocket mirror, my girl. All that I can say? Mm-hmm. Deepest regrets. <laughs> I know this voice. So, did your um, record not say that? It did not. Well, you got the wrong wicked. Probably. My mine literally just said like a loud. It had, had a loud shh. And then I was like, okay, that caught me off guard. Did you go all the way up? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm. I'm on the same level where the records are, but I'm on the, uh, the, the left side of the room. Vorschlag zu Ihnen Historien Friedrich Curses by Adam Müller. So yep. you were just there. I'm, I'm, I'm there, and there's a pile of letters right next to that, and that's the... There's a pile of letters on the floor. Yeah. These all seem to be medical letters. After analyzing the patient's mental health, 
these past few days, I can now securely state my diagnosis. It has come to my attention that the patient, at least the hillage, is been having is been having nightly visions imbalance of bodily humors and melancholia. That sounds imbalance. disgusting. Such behavior is not harmful to other members of the subject's family. However, it is quickly wearing down the subject's health. The patient should spend their days at ease with moderate consumption of thin white wine, the practice of gentle exercise, warm black baths, plenty of sleep, moderate carnal co co copulation, copulation. Whoa, 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 um, and exposure to soothing music. What's the woe for? Nothing. Have you I never shall, heard that? I shall pay the pace in the village to visit each a month from now to verify the progression of the symptoms. That's All right. Let's go up again. Wh but where did you find your record, though? Because my record was on the same level on the uh, the right side, um, kind of where like the 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 grandfather clock is, just you know, upstairs. Grandfather clock. Yeah. What did I say? I don't see no grandfather clock. Well, the okay, so the grandfather clock is on the uh, the bottom, right? There's two grandfather clocks on the floor on each side. So on the right side, there's a grandfather clock, right? So if I'm standing kind of at the same level where the grandfather clock is, that's where I found the uh, the wax whatever and yours didn't say anything no okay did you go to your items when you were next to the thing to, to what thing the record player no should i yes okay i'm going in my items then how did you hear this you didn't hear the shh no um wax record one of five okay let me click on that Oh, okay, I see. You put the record on the... And it says, I'm a recording. Leave you my... Children. My testimony... Oh. Okay. It seems to be going, like, super fast. Everything Mother could do for you. Hope it is. Your pocket mirror, my girl. Oh, you already read all this stuff. Deepest regrets. I know this voice. Okay, so here's what happened. I didn't realize that you had to put the uh, the the wax thing that we found mm -hmm. into the record player. So I clicked on the record player without putting anything on there, and then you heard a loud shh. Mm. So maybe I didn't hear that when I clicked on it. Oh, okay. Well, could I be hearing shit? I mean, that's always a possibility, uh, right? Maybe. I'm sure it's, it's it'll be on the recording. I don't know. Whatever. Um, I'm I'm. Let's go on up. Yeah, I'm going up. Are you going right or left? I'm going left first. I'm going right. Sitting under a large tree, a group of people look up at this guy as the as if enjoying a soft prim primeval breeze. It's called Dreaded Daylight. Such a depressing name. Okay, so there's really nothing to the right. A book fell when you try to go down. The handwriting is a bit faded. Cla Clavicula Salamanus Regis. This is in Latin, isn't it? So I'm just clicking on stuff. Well, go, go, go left. Go left. 
Mm -hmm. Hold on, I'm still clicking and stop. It's a really big Bible. There's a musical score scattered here. Joseph Haydn. Haydn. <laughs> Haydn. Symphony number 26 in D minor, Lamentation. Um, clicking on stuff. Book file. Okay, and are, are you at the book? Well, I'm trying to read this letter that's on the floor on the left side. Not readable. Got it. Okay, so check out this book that fell. What? H hold on. Is this? Okay, there it goes. What is this? Um. Uh. Some kind of a picture. Well, I guess that's Gib right there. Which one of the two? There's three. Well, no, I know, but which one of the two little girls is Yeb? Oh. The other one on the left. Left side. Yeah, that makes sense. That's why she recognizes the voice. It's and a Faza. Y yeah, I agree. And and so here's what's happening. This girl that we found, that's obviously her sister, right? Like, that makes sense. And No, but this person is short hair. What? The girl in the picture. The, the the one that I think is her sister? Um, Harpe's not her sister. Well, okay, Harpe's gotta be her sister. Nah. So, okay, here here's what I think is happening. We we just read a, some kind of a medical report where the, the report says that, like, the person's basically going crazy. I think the Eve character is going crazy. Nah, I think it's her, the sister. Eve's sister. I think it's... Not Harpe, I think it's... Uh, Harpe's not her sister. I uh, think it's Yeep's sister in there, her pic this picture right here. R right, isn't that Harpe? No, it can't be. Why not? Because that person has brown hair. Yeah, well this is... You know, I used to have blonde hair. It doesn't work like that. Why not? It works like that in real life. Like, I literally had blonde hair. No. When I, when I was a kid, yeah. Have I never have I never shown you pictures of me as a kid? Uh, Harpe's not not her sister. No. Okay. <laughs> so I just clicked the picture off. All right, let's leave. Oh, dots. Yeah, dots. Oh, leave. oh, okay. I guess not. Oh. Why am I in that photograph? Aha. Clock strikes thirteen. Stupid smart weather. What's going on? Can I leave? I'm scared. The the I'm bell's scared. really bell's really annoying. So I'm guessing we have to go to the grandfather clock to stop it. Okay, well the it stopped. It stopped I'm gonna leave. You're gonna leave where? The room. All the way at the bottom? Like the main Oh good, a save box. Where? Where's your save box? When you leave the room. What room? <laughs> the library. Yeah, but where did you go? Did you go to the main entrance of, yeah. of the library? Okay. When we came out, when we came in. I, I I think we should end it here. Really? Yeah. I mean, when are we gonna get another save box? We never know. I guess we could end it here. Um. That's up to you. Do you really want to end it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, then, we will end the video here. Do you have anything to say to our viewers? Um, always, um, eat your, eat your saltine salt side up. But isn't sodium, like, supposed to be really bad for you? Um... Always take your your medicine. I would say... And, and if people think you're possessed, just tell them you're having a seizure. I, I don't think seizure people can talk when they're having their seizure. Like, I've, I've been around people that had seizures during their seizure. Th no, but like really. afterwards. But, okay, so, so what do we do while they're having their seizure? What do you do, mean? Do we think that they're possessed? 
Do we, yeah. Do we call a priest? Yeah. But what if instead of calling a priest, we should be calling a doctor where the doctor would we'll, actually we'll, be able to save their life instead of a priest who, you know... We'll call bullshit. the Ghostbusters. Do you have their number? Yeah. What is it? It's a 911 Ghostbuster. That sounds accurate. Yeah. Okay. So I guess we can end the video. Um... I guess we can play again in another month or two. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, I guess. All right. Yeah. Well, same bat time, same bat channel. We'll be back in a flash. Dun, dun, dun. If the flash is Barry Allen and he messes up the timeline. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>